So a lot of people are convinced that super scale is just a glorified sharpening or that you could just use a sharpen uh, plugin and it will do the job. Well, in this video, I'm gonna test it out and I'm gonna show you which one works better. So in order to get to the bottom of this, I had to take an HD clip and drop it on an 8K timeline where I activated super scale on the one clip and then added a sharpen effect on the other clip. So for the full tutorial on how to use super scale, you can check out this link over here. So this was the result. I am currently zoomed in 400% so that we can look at all the details in the shot. This is the original so you can see that it is quite blurry. So when we go to the sharpen effect you can see that it looks a little bit better. I mean there's a little bit more detail but it does look a lot more muddy. And then let's go look at the super scale one. Oh my goodness, can you believe that? That is fantastic. I mean, the detail just pops and all the muddiness goes away. It's almost like super scale detects the lines. So it just smooths it out quite nicely. So let's go to a different part of this clip. So this is going to be a nice clip just to see all the different detail and text in the shot. This is the original HD clip on a 4K timeline, uh, zoomed in 400%. So let's check out what the sharpened one looks like. And then let's go to the super scale one to see if we can see a major difference. Oh my word, would you look at that? I mean, that looks absolutely amazing. I mean, all the detail that Superscale is bringing back is really something. So guys, I hope that this answers your question whether Superscale is the real deal. If you wanna increase the quality of a low res clip on a high res timeline, then Superscale is the right tool to use. See you in the next video, cheers.